Hi guys, so thinking probably a lot of you at home bored looking for more things on YouTube to watch and Netflix so I won't be on Netflix but I can add something to YouTube if you're very bored um, because my life has been for me fantastic lately but for you probably not very interesting we moved back to Sweden. I don't know if I made any update about this, but me and Wolfie, we uh, <laughs> went on a vacation to Sweden, decided to stay, and then he went back for a little bit, but it was decided that he would come and live with me too. Uh, I got an amazing job here as a, well, amazing, but like, you know, like a personal assistant in a very lovely family. It's very calm, um, it's very easy, and I'm very lucky. It's night work though, so sometimes I'm a little bit in a daze. It's like, you know, when you work a lot of nights, you uh, kind of feel like you're in one long night, especially during Swedish winter. But I've been able to draw some at work too, which is extremely lucky. And that way I've had time to continue to do Tadas a bit. But the activity, I don't know, it was good for a while. And then lately we started doing more like family stuff. Uh, like introducing Wolfie to my family, uh, me spending more time with my nephew. We got engaged. Marcus got a flask. I proposed, and uh, if things work out, you know, with a, if if things are open again in the summer, then we're um, supposed to get married during the. Mm, medieval week in uh, in Gotland in Sweden which could be lovely but getting married is just like a fun thing uh, so it's not super important if it has to be cancelled we can do it later this was supposed to be just like a small thing and right now I am uh, in week seven just stepping into week seven pregnant you know that week where people are going like don't tell anyone or like all this it's crazy like the when you, this is my first time in my life pregnant, and I'm very excited about it. Um, but I also say, that, you know, if I, if I tell someone, I say I'm pregnant, I, I don't say I'm having a baby. Because, like, the first 12 weeks, anything can happen. Uh, like, it's a pretty, it's like a 20% overall risk of uh, losing the baby. Not as in, like, the very horrible term in English, like miscarriage. Like, like your mom carried it wrong. Um, so I'm aware of that, but when I tell people, there's a lot of people who are like, oh, you shouldn't tell. But like, fuck you, I just told you, don't make me feel bad about it. It's like, I, I'm aware of the risks. But anyway, yes, I'm very happy. And also, I suppose, like, this kind of pregnancy brain makes me different. Like, I struggle in my normal day-to-day -day life with, like, the four stages of my hormone cycle and it making me kind of into different people and being creative and trying to be structured during those changes are actually difficult. People don't talk about that a lot, but people also, well, women, have different, uh, different amounts of troubles with it. Some people don't even notice, uh, but I definitely do. And now it's a whole different thing. Now it's pregnancy brain, and my pregnancy brain is like the comic thing. It's like, <laughs> baby. And I don't think that's you know, necessarily wrong. It definitely hurts the like, artistic pride in me a bit but i do still want to do the comic but i paused my patreon uh right now because i don't make enough new comics partly because i'm sorry i'm very tired i want to sleep all the time so i'm uh, yeah pausing a little bit definitely not saying i'm quitting because you know pregnancy brain we'll see what happens later i ne i never did well with like being bored for that it's also good to have breaks so I don't know and uh, yeah there's a coronavirus outbreak you you might have noticed and in Sweden like in my life I know for some people this is devastating and it's just beginning or uh, not to be like it might just be beginning but in Sweden it's very calm so far some stores ran out of toilet paper for a bit uh, my boyfriend uh, lost his uh, job until until further notice because restaurant works are not going very well luckily we have a flatmate uh, so we're sharing rent and my work pays pretty good for being night work so 
uh, we're fine and yeah very lucky like you know if you're a gamer or a bit introverted isolation you don't you won't notice it much I imagine like some really outdoorsy social people uh, will suffer but us us Netflixers and uh, gamers and yeah especially in couples very lucky like we don't suffer much so I just hope it won't be going on for too long but yeah so very like unartisty news for you <laughs> I'm happy I'm very comfortable and I think I'll focus on family life for a bit and probably come back uh, I'm not gonna go away but you know be a bit less into it and when I fully come back if I fully come back probably come back a little less salty I'm guessing you know more like make a better world for my uh, for my baby if I have a baby you know but then obviously nothing is sure but we'll see I hope you guys are doing good I really do I've been looking at myself this whole time the camera is there oh well phones <laughs> you awake? I wanted to like tell you in some fun way but I can't sleep <laughs> Thank you for that. Mm -hmm. See you later. Mm -hmm. It's weak, but it's two, and it's in two of them. That's it.